hello and welcome to today's video we solve for the value of c so we have c plus c divided by c should give us c so what are we going to do the first step we are going to take is to multiply both sides by c so we're going to have this as c plus c is equal to c multiplied by c since if we multiply this side by c also we shall multiply this side by c this one and this one will cancel so we shall remain with c plus c is equal to c multiplied by c so this is the same as c plus c this is 2c is equal to c squared now with this we can have this in this manner c squared is equal to 2c if 2c moves to the left then i'm going to have c squared minus 2c is equal to a zero so we know that if i have c being common then i can factor it out so we're going to have this as c into c minus 2 is equal to a zero so for my first value of c c1 it shall be zero this one then for my c2 we get this one to zero so i'm going to have c minus 2 is equal to a zero the value of c this will move to the right so that i have my c as positive 2 so this is c2 so c1 is 0 c2 is 2 so what we are meaning with is just verification so we shall begin with 0 so we have this as 0 plus 0 divided by 0 should give us a 0 so everything here is actually equal to a zero so we shall have zero being equal to a zero and you notice that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side this means that zero satisfies our expression now what about when using two if we are using two then you're going to have this as two plus two divided by two should give us a two this so 2 plus 2 that is 4 so 4 divided by 2 should give us a 2 2 year 1 2 year 2 2 is equal to 2 and also this second value of c satisfies our expression this means that both the two values of c satisfy the expression so this is basically the simple steps that you can take to solve for the value of c and also verify the validity of your answer let me hope you've enjoyed our presentation and if so then go ahead and hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe thank you for watching this video